Okay, folks, this will be an interesting one. It's aimed at little children, and it comes across to me as a form of, oh, I just got a message from YouTube. No, it's just across the phone. It just gets in my face. Yeah, uh, yeah, this is the thing that I hate, hate this kind of advertising and marketing. Shall I say marketing uh, towards little children and getting them interested and... <sighs> really quite annoying the way marketing is often aimed especially in toys aimed at kids you know kids don't know what's right and what's wrong pretty much especially when they're really young and they get treated as marketing and advertising pawns and really it's quite to me it's disgusting um, but you know you get that unfortunately in this money fucked depraved world that we live in doesn't make it acceptable folks especially when it's toys that are making adult behavior bad behavior um, like something that children aspire to They're copying what the adults do anyway let's see what this shit is these are what's known as shopkins they're like I think it's all about encouraging children to spend money at the shops you know go shopping so it's about teaching children the adult uh, activity of uh, what do they call it market what do they call it the uh, uh oh, fuck, i forgot what they call it when you get really down and low and you're feeling sad uh retail therapy that's the words retail therapy so this is like teaching children Things like retail therapy, like when you're feeling down, go shopping, you know, go shopping. It's all make you feel better. Buy some clothing, buy some shoes, buy some handbags, yeah, that sort of shit. And, you know, you'll feel right. It's all okay. It's fucking uh, <laughs> retail therapy. It's bullshit. Uh, anyway, enough of that. That's come up looking really quite interesting with these silly, dumb, dumb shopkins. Um, I just don't understand, you know, how adults can be so fucking low like that to try to get children to buy these sorts of um, products which are really like bad adult behaviour. Um, try to see which way this is going to go. But yeah, you just... It's just not acceptable, but the stupid adults that, that like to market this shit don't seem to care that they're, they're hurting children. They're hurting them, folks. Kids will start screaming at their parents to buy sh the latest Shopkins. Collectible. And they're collectibles. And collectibles are bad news because they always have rare ones. And children don't seem to understand that... that it, it's, a, it's, a lot, it's like a lottery trying to get the rare ones. And you keep buying them, and it's bad for the planet as well because basically they become throwaway items. You know, the ones that you collect and you don't want because you've already got them. So it's really not acceptable, but that's the way all this silly marketing goes. And it really is silly and it's horrible and it's mean and mean spirited and all that. But what can you do? It's like, fuck, it's everywhere. It's like, fuck, the bloody. Retail shit is everywhere. Oh, look, it's okay to go shopping, folks, but please, you know, don't make little children become like this, you know, to become like little adults, little mum and dads having a, a splurge. Look, there's nothing wrong with money per se, but when money becomes a fucking deity and a fucking worship, that's when it really becomes a problem, and little children should never be exploited like that just because they're soft, soft targets and their parents have to fucking try to stop their child from screaming and yelling and demanding this product and that product and really I, I'm so over the way they do that the way adults are so fucking mean spirited to the little children um, but what can you do, you know, the world has become so money fucked so fucking stupid fucking dumb dumb as fuck um 
Dumb as fuck, folks. Really, really stupid. But what can you do, folks? Rich people have it over you. You know, they have their own fucking way. They do their own fucking thing. They do their own fucking thing and they they, they couldn't give a flying fuck about the, the little children and the parents that get crushed by their children's screaming and demands. Pester power is what they call it. Often referred to as keeping uh, chocolate bars, lollies and other colourful confectionery at ch children's eye, eye height, at a, typically at a supermarket. And yeah, that's it. They, the, the children demand, they scream, they stomp their feet, you know, but they don't know any better. And it's because the adults in the marketing world have done this and have made a fucking mess of the family dynamics of people's lives. It's so intrusive, so mean and horrible, and it ruins family lives. You know, and the kids get angry at the parents, the parents get panicked, not knowing what to do when the child explodes into a rage and keeps foot laying on the ground and not getting up, you know what I mean? Children like to drop themselves on the ground when they don't get their own way. And you see them being dragged around by their parents because they choose they refuse to to walk and they get really angry and they want that item, they want this. And that's what Shopkins is all about. It's just bullshit. You know, it's fuck. And oh, I don't care what these companies think of me. I don't give a flying fuck. You can go fuck your child abuse advertising, sh Shopkins. I don't know the company you are. I forgot. I haven't looked it up on the label, but I know that brand. And you're all a bunch of assholes that care only about money. Leave the children alone, bitches! Suts. Sluts, leave the children alone, you fucks. Shopkins, whoever you are, whatever your fucking brand is, go fuck yourselves and your fucking child abuse. Go fuck yourselves. I hope fucking, hope fucking something goes wrong in your life. You child abusers. How dare you? How dare you ruin the, the dynamics of people, people's families? How dare you make it hard for parents and children to get along. How dare you? Stupid fuckwits. Child abusers. Fuckwits. I found this. I'm trying to think where I found it. I found it outside an op shop. Uh, normally I donate it, but because it's got such evil-ish evil, if that's the right word, or corrupt material, we'll show you what I'm going to do with it in a moment. So that's our fucking finished item. Make something interesting out of this piece of shit. Anyway, I'm just going to demonstrate what I think of Shopkins, folks. Okay, Shopkins, this is where Shopkins belongs. In the bin. There you go. Shopkins done. Yay! <laughs> there you go, folks. Shopkins. I've just demonstrated my hatred for this brand. Anyway, enough of that. I think we can now call this demo quits.